Alrighty guys, welcome back to episode of NBA 2K14. So, we just got to win the last uh, the last episode, the last game. And, um, I don't know, it wasn't our best performance, but it wasn't bad. It's another win for the Pistons, who bring the total to five in a row now. Trevor really seemed to be enjoying himself last night. I hope you're ready for us next game. It'll be a good one, but I think we'll come out on top. Yo, I just got done dancing around the house, and I had to come on here and give it to the Pistons props for five straight wins. Yeah, five in a row. That's awesome. Okay, so we actually have some things we have to do here before we head to the next uh, um, next game. We've got to spend some money, baby. We've got 2,549 um, points or VC, whatever. Let's let's increase our, our three point by 10. Holy crap. Oh, we can't. Shit. Let's increase our three point by nine. Oh, my God. Woo! And you already thought we were good at threes. After this, we're going to start upgrading, uh, I don't know, what do we want to go through next? I think so. mid-range game could be improved a bit. Close-range game could be improved a bit. Maybe our, like, jump or, or dunk could be improved a bit. Um, also, I think ball handling, maybe some more defense. Um, steals are always good. Let's go ahead and put steals up by two. Uh, I, just, I want, to, want to get what we're good at first. So, like, threes and steals. And quickness, acceleration, I think, is some of the stuff we should focus on first. And then we'll work on making him a more well-rounded player. But we take a lot of threes. So, so adding nine to our three-point game there was pretty freaking crazy. All right, let's go ahead and, uh, and continue on to the next game. Let's put this, uh, this newfound three-point ability to the test, baby. Woo! This should be good. I kind of like that. Like, we haven't upgraded our guy in, in quite a few games in a row. It's probably been like eight or nine games, so we had a lot of points saved up to, uh, to be able to spend on him. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Do they let you buy those VCs? <clears throat> I'm not sure. It kind of seems like something they'd let you buy if you wanted to, like, pay to win. I won't ever do that. Don't worry, guys. Like, something like GTA buying money, that's fine. Because, you know, that helps you make more entertaining stuff and have more fun online, you know, with cool cars and stuff. But paying our way to becoming a good player and instantly being, like, the best in the league and all that. No, that's stupid. So here we go. See what we got. Who are we playing? I'm not even sure. I wasn't paying attention. This is 2K Sports bringing you the NBA. Oh, the Hawks again. Okay. Let's do it. Let's have a better showing than last time. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. We're going up against Jared Cunningham again. This guy, uh, he defended us pretty well last time. He, uh, he, he did a good job against let's us, so over to Doris Burke, uh, let's try to, uh, to do Doris. a little bit better here. Kevin, I asked Ooh, that's not who I wanted to pass it to, but... Most confident in today, and he said it's probably the depth Whew. of perimeter shooting talent Somebody should have hit me. He said our guys can flat out shoot it, and you're going to see it today. Bad call for pass. How? I'm Doris, cutting to the you. basket. No Clark hard to create spacing. Nice. Oh, offensive oh, rebound and a score. Hunter career points. Nice. That's awesome. Oh, wow, I didn't realize we were down by two as well. Okay, cool. Eastern Conference, we're leading the Eastern Conference, baby. Nine and two. That's awesome. And of course, Atlanta, four and a half. How crazy would it be if we won the finals? You know, I think for Detroit, they've actually taken the NBA by storm year. since the season kicked off. They put themselves right in the mix with the league's top teams when most people thought they'd be bottom. Woo! Oh, no! That was a really good pump fake. I totally thought we were blocking that. Really tough to get that shot off with the size differential there. It's not an individual matchup he's going to win every time, especially in the post. Very well done. I didn't think he had any business operating down there. Had pass. How? It worked out well. Where's my assist? here for Drummond. And guys, they continue so you're going to take away team points for making a bad pass, but you're not going to give me the points for an assist. That's unreal. That is some booty. Some booty me. And this dude's just going to freaking jack one in my face. All right. That's what she said. 
That is exactly what she said. 19 years with the San Antonio Spurs, including 17 as an assistant. Boy, you couldn't ask for a better teaching ground. Nice pass. Now give me the assist this time. Thank you. All right, there we go. shot is looking really good here in the first. Teammate grades looking better. He's nailing everything. Let's keep it going. We're one for one. 100% field goal percentage with a two. Assist and a rebound. Nice. This is a pretty good start to a game. Kind of uh, low key. It's nothing crazy, but. And play stops. Whistle on what looks to be an illegal screen. And back to Budenholzer, who was with the Spurs Ricks for 19 work. years. Steve, the Spurs, the winningest team in pro sports over the last 15 years. Yeah, I'm glad that Budenholzer has finally gotten his chance. I All right, I want to try out the new three-point uh, skill. The He's very dedicated, hardworking, and uh, has learned from probably the best coach in the NBA. Got him! That's C-plus quality, too, so that wasn't even a good one. Nice. All right. Well, that ties it up. So for the Pistons, their last game, a win against the Hawks in Atlanta. And guys, they could have won that game on the strength of their offense alone. It was that good. And to do it on the road, too. I mean, with the way they just kept coming at them and coming at them, they kept that crowd out of the game the entire time. Get another rebound. Come on. Yes. 17 seconds left. Let's make a play down here. I don't care if it's me. I don't care if it's a teammate. I just want to make a play. Martin dishes to your red card. Bad pass, bad pass, bad pass. Woo! Wow, so I guess you don't get assist points if it's considered a bad pass. Whatever, we still got it done. We scored. So, that's all that matters. I'm not worried about my own personal gain. I want the team to win. I want the team to do well. Because when the team does well, I do well. Okay, let's start it up here. Second quarter. See what we can do. Starting on the bench, coming in with 247 left. Man, I hate that. I know I keep saying that, guys, but I hate it. Bad call for pass. Why? Because he's somewhat across the court. Give me the damn ball. God. So we're 100% from the court here, from the three-point line, from, from inside everywhere. And it's Bynum. That's pretty cool. And it's Drummond in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. That's the group for Detroit Good right D. now. Pistons leading by seven. Drummond sets the screen for Bynum. Outside, Martin. Got him! Holy shit! Man. And the thing is, all my releases have been excellent. I guess not just because... Uh, We upgraded his three points, so that obviously has a lot to do with it. But we've also been hitting a lot of excellence. Out to the right wing, launches it. Oh, I wanted that. Damn it, Drummond. Detroit's gone downtown 13 times in this game, and they're just over 50 percent. Seven of 13 on threes. Caldwell Pope passes to Drummond. Puts it up. That's short off the rim. It's all right. Well. The no worries. Was not smooth for Jay Smooth last year as he had some wow, good shot. The Hawks organization at times was even suspended a game by the We're on fire. Woo! Wow, that is not who I wanted to pass it to. There was a guy that was wide open. To the left wing. Pistons passing it around. Martin for three. Oh my gosh, quality was a minus and it was an an excellent yeah, release. How did we yeah. not make yeah, that? I mean, Damn it. I wanted to keep it 100%. I was nervous about taking a shot, but I thought for sure we'd Number make two, that one. Covered by Smith. And we were on fire. Shot clock at six. No problems knocking that one down. What's the score here? We're up by five? Okay. Oop, we're still on fire. That's good. Josh Smith is from Atlanta. Some misgivings there really Whoa! That would have been so dirty. Nice. Out of bounds. Pistons, Pistons ball. Let's do it. We moved a small forward. Atlanta making a switch here. And a two for one opportunity. Yeah, they've got to hurry. Step on the gas here. The drive by Bynum. Good move, Bynum. Of, of course you don't make it, though. Nobody ever does. Well, probably the right play defensively. If you can't get the wow, box, so we weren't on fire that last play, and now it's saying we're on fire. No easy buckets inside. Crazy. Force free throws and work to keep them out of the lane next time around. All right, sweet. We've got 22 seconds left 22 to play. 22 seconds in the left in the half. 
Here's Mack. He'll set the screen. But three. It'll go Oof, to the man, he drained it. Now to just four points with the basket from Cunningham. We're going to answer back here. Seven seconds left in the first half. Outside, Mark jacks up a three. Oh, the my gosh. Quality was D. Oh, timing was... We, we've got the timing down now, and I'm sure our upgraded three-pointers kind of uh, made it a little bit easier to hit, but... Um, you know, uh, man. Everybody's got to get involved. Uh, you know, whenever we have the opportunity to run the floor and get out and get some easy layups... Uh, be able to do that and, and be able to finish plays. And, uh, that's all we have to do, and I think we'll be okay. And I see you, Josh Smith. To you all right. Sprint. Well, we had a really strong start. I'm and upset we missed those two threes at the end. They were kind of... Well, one of them wasn't forced at all. One of them was perfect. It was excellent with an A uh, shot selection, whatever. That last one was kind of forced just because we wanted to... Um, wanted to score at the end, but... The Hawks trail by eight, and so in the game for the Hawks. They've got Damari Carroll out there. Sugar All right. Is out there with Cunningham. Then there's Paul Millsap, and it's Ontich in at the five. Let's just keep it up. Let's get up to a B. <coughs> we need to get up to a B minus or a B. But they're rebounding. They've given themselves a lot of second chances. The Hawks play some really good perimeter defense, though, so it's kind of hard for for us to to make any difference. I guess that means we should take it to the to the rim then, but. You know, last season the Hawks were a solid team on the road. Nothing spectacular. And really what you'd expect from a three seed in the East. End of the year with a 19-22 road record. Wow, that's not who I was trying to pass it to. I was trying to pass the guy down low with a reach around bounce pass. Would have set him up right underneath the basket. It would have been perfect. On a consistent level, he can knock down some open ones. Schroeder kicks to Cunningham. How did we not steal that? We were in front of that ball. And there's a whistle. That Damn it. Reach and foul. That's his first foul. Well, Clark, you said it about the Hawks last year, 19 and 22 on the road. You really need to hover around 500 on the road. Don't you think, Steve, to position nice. yourself for the playoffs? No question. As long as you can control your home court uh, and get a good record there, then 500 on the road is just fine. But this is a Hawks team that's looking to take the next step, Kevin, to, to really become Come on. Lead. Give it to me. There it is. Assist. Like All right, let's at least get up to a B minus, guys. That's what we need here. For the rest of his teammates. The Hawks trail by 11. One thirty-two left in the third quarter. To the left side wing. Woo! Thought we were stealing that. Pass to Schroeder. Shot clock at five. Here's Cunningham. He trains it as the shot clock ticks down. That was a crazy move. Nice job, Cunningham. Okay. Oh. Something they did not mean to call for that ball. More often, that's for sure. 102 left in the third quarter of the game. Give me the damn ball. What are you doing, Billups? Good lord. <laughs> He's just sitting there. Double team did not pass the ball off. No comparison in the shooting percentages between the teams since the break. Out to the wing. Carroll passes to Schroeder. Hawks passing it around. Kicks to Cunningham. What do we got here? Not crash the boards? Ah! Damn it. Thought we were gonna get a rebound there. 11 2 and 2. We're not doing too bad. This is this is a solid game. Like, it's nothing spectacular, but it's not It's not awful. We're we're doing our part to uh to get the W. Back to Martin. 16 seconds left in the third. All sorts of time. Oh! Damn it! Man, we have really cooled down. We were on fire there for a bit. Oh my gosh, another reach in foul. Wow, and they're going to get free throws out of it. Holy crap. That was stupid. Oh well, we're going to have to hit a three down at the other end of the court to make up for this, okay? We got to have a three at the end, guys. Got to have a three. Oh, we're passing the ball in. Damn it. Throws it from deep. Almost. Alright, well, we're up by eight points at the end of the third. We've slowed down a little bit. We're still having a good game. We just we slowed down. 
he would be having a great game, but. And so the big win by Atlanta in a tight game. What the fudge? They managed to come up with the win. You know, nobody wants to lose a close game, Kevin. It's much better. Really? You're going to take me out for the rest of the game and my team is just going to lose it because of my AI? Oh my gosh, that makes me really mad. Oh well, all right. Well, I don't even want to hear your post game interview. That's some bullshit. All right, I'll see you guys next episode. Thanks for watching. Peace out.